Hello there, this is Adam Bowles. So quick question, have you ever heard this sound before? Or this sound? And if you stay late enough around nine o'clock, you'll hear this. And I'm a new civilian, and I found out about 75% of the entire base's direct workforce is civilian. So that's why I went out to see what these traditions actually are, why they are so important, and what we should do when we hear them. We just assume that new hires know the military customs. They know the ranks or they know why the music's playing. But uh, that's a big assumption that um, we need to uh, break that barrier and that not assume that everybody knows. For a while there, it was fairly annoying, right? I felt I was like, what are we stopping for all the time? It, but I've chosen just take it in and every time I hear it, uh, remember what it is that uh, it, it stands for. So I always get kind of annoyed when people just are in a rush and then speed on by because we're all in a rush. But I think it's important to remember why we stop for that, what, 120 seconds in the morning, 190 seconds in the evening. So it's just something to think about for the civilians like, hey, you know, stop, take a moment, reflect why we do what we do. So to tie in why we render those courtesies, you're actually rendering those courtesies to the flag. One protocol that mandates that, you know, when we're driving in a vehicle and we hear the Reveille, we stop our cars and wait for Reveille to complete. But it's also respect and honor for the flag and what it, what it symbolizes, that sacrifice, especially for the military. We know of people who've died either in combat, out of combat. So, so you're also paying respect for those, um, those sacrifices that people honor. The history of taps. It was used to signify, you know, lights out. Like, you know, hey, um, lights out, it's time for bed. However, if you're at a military funeral, taps is also played. And it's the final respects being paid to, the, to that sacrifice as well. I, I, I just tell civilians, don't feel out of sorts. Ask questions and then you'll know, um, oh wow, when the music's playing in the evening, um, stop your car you know someone needs to share that with you because you may not know think about what those traditions mean think about what those sacrifices mean and why we're doing what we're doing why we're here on this base why we're running tests to support the downrange mission and now understand we're working shoulder to shoulder with the men and women in uniform we're a force to be reckoned with helping the air force be ready for action and ready for anything <laughs>